Here with Cody Hilton, head coach of Northwest Gilford Middle School boys basketball. Just got a good win over Western Gilford. Coach, talk about some of the good things your team did today. Yes, absolutely. It was a uh, great bounce back game for us. You know, we uh, we struggled Monday coming off the uh, the Christmas break, and uh, you know tonight our energy was fantastic on defense. Um, you know, we missed a lot of easy buckets there in the first half. We got some great looks that weren't going in. Our guys stuck with it. Uh, they kept playing. They moved the ball great. And uh, you know, we just stuck with it and finally got some some of those shots to fall in the second half. And I was very happy with our effort tonight. Much better than uh, Monday. So it was a good talk game about, for us. Tonight. Talk about your big men. Your big men inside put the ball in the bucket pretty well today. They did. Uh, Quinn Leach, uh, Jack, Jack Alder, Trenton uh, Van Wert. They uh, they were all very good catching the ball with two hands, uh, finishing strong with both hands around the rim. Uh, so very proud. Very proud of them. Talk about the job I think uh, Adam Revis does at a guard for you. I don't know if he had any points, right? I think the things he does on shuffling the box score, but he does a lot of big things for you out there. Yes, he sure does. I mean, his energy on defense, getting deflections, uh, getting steals is uh, is huge for us, and he gets us in our offense, and, uh, and he looks for those guys too. And uh, you know, it's it's huge to have a guy like that to kind of run the team, and you know, you can tell him one thing, and he communicates it with the offense, and uh, so he's a huge part of this group, and uh, hopefully he can. And curious going forward, so love having him. Felt like your team was going to play well today. Watching the fifth quarter game, some of your fifth yeah. quarter players like they could start for some other teams. Gosh, man, it's a it's a fun group. I tell you, we always tell or I tell the guys, you know, it starts in fifth quarter. You know, they bring the energy, and uh, and that's the first time our team steps out on the court. So uh, we like to to start out hot, you know, with fifth quarter, and, and those kids are good. And like yeah, like you said, um, they're good players. Just uh, unfortunately, are behind right now some some good eighth graders and a few seven. Um, so, you know, they're they're good kids. Uh, love them to death. And, um, you know, hopefully they can help us out next year. So. Talk about some things your team did not do you like today, some things you got to work on. Yeah, gosh, we uh, we struggled a little bit there in the first half just swinging the basketball. We kept it on one side of the court. You know, we had some open shooters that if we just made two or three passes, um, you know, we, we would have had open shots. So just reversing the ball, looking opposite, you know, trying to break the press. Um, so definitely we can work on uh, just making that one more pass, you know, getting passing up good shots for great shots. So, so looking ahead the rest of the season, what are some other things you got to do to get better? I think um, – Finishing around the rim, you know, we, we got we got to our spots, we got the shots we wanted, but going up strong, you know, finishing. Um, you know, Monday we didn't handle the pressure well. I thought tonight we did, so I, that was a, a good good thing to see. Um, but just continuing to to play defense um, and shooting the basketball. You know, we're kind of streaky. We got good shooters, um, but uh, hopefully we can. Uh, you know, get hot and stay consistent with it. So, uh, you know, that's one thing I, I love is get guys that can shoot, and so we, we try to, to to keep that up. So, shooting the ball and playing good defense. So, you're a busy man. I think you're. Are you helping the varsity son this year too? Yeah, you know, most of the games that they have at home, uh, you know, I try to, to help them out as much as possible in some of their practices, and uh, so you know, try to help Coach Revis as, as much as I can. Uh, so it's a good thing we got going here. So you got some good energy up there this year too on the varsity team. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they, uh, gosh, they, they play as hard as uh, as hard as possible. Uh, they've had some some close games. They've been in every game, uh, you know, and it's it's tough, uh, you know, losing some of the guys from last year and um, you know some guys transferred out. So uh, he, he's Coach Revis has done a good job with, with what we got, and uh, I like his group. Um, and uh, they've got a lot of young kids too. Some of your guys that played for you, I mean, you look at yes. Palumbo and yes. some of those other kids that played for you up there playing a lot of time on varsity. Oh, yeah, now. very happy to see what Caleb's doing. Um, you know, he can shoot the heck out of the ball. And it's been really fun to see him contribute right away for him. And uh, so they, they got a bright future for sure. Some fresh it's a dumb little guard up there too out of play for you also. Oh, gosh. Who was the kid that went to the foul out last Friday night and made the first oh, and the second? Uh, Dawson Ezrin. Yeah. Yes, yeah. he sure did. He sure did. In seventh grade, his eighth grade year was the COVID year, so we didn't get to have him. But uh, Ryan Debo played here. Um, very good athlete. Um, so yeah, there's there's a bunch of guys up there. Connor Nix would have COVID year, kind of shut that down too. So uh, always fun to see guys go over there and succeed um, that come through here. So we definitely keep tabs on them and, and keep up with what they're doing. So it's uh, it's a good program. Shows the process program. is working for you. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. Love to see them develop and get better. And uh, that's really all you can all you can ask, especially at this level. So. Well, Cody Hilton, Dan Hilton, the entire Hilton family, keep up the good work. <laughs> we'll sure do it. Thank you, Andy.